I want to show you how to put an IDX broker widget on your Wix site. You come over here to add and then hit the embed and then you'll put an HTML frame. So this puts a what's called an iframe on your on your Wix site. So where you'll come over here and grab this code for example if we're grabbing one from IDX add-ons I'm going to go under apps and grab the featured listings uh, widget right here. Click it so it opens in a new tab. This is really important when you do this for uh, for Wix. And then you can bring the code over here. Click on settings and then where this code is we'll put in the little paragraph tags there, the P and then the uh, forward slash P and in between those we can paste that code that, that we just got off there. So there's our there's our little widget. Uh, this is going to update automatically um, you know, as your IDX broker listings update. So you might need to style this a little bit, uh, maybe a little CSS code or something, or adjust these so that it has the kind of layout and uh, shows the information right here in a way that you that you like. You can also get any widget from IDX broker. So you click on Design Website Widgets and um, you can grab any of these widgets here. We're going to use this featured showcase. And I'll just show you a couple settings that you're going to want to set on these. You're going to want to make sure that the setting for responsive is set to yes. And then down here, open widget links in a new window. That's going to be yes. So, so it'll pop out of that iframe. And then this display view all results link. I like putting yes there. Columns. And then you put in the number of listings, which determines the number of rows. The more columns you have, the smaller the images are. So you can save that, and then if you want to see it, click over here to view all widgets. And when you click that, you hit that preview icon there, and you can see kind of what that's going to look like. So you just copy this code from right down here. Uh, and then you can basically, we're going to pull up that same code snippet that we put previously. And then we'll just paste the new uh, widget in here and then hit update and it will pull the new widget uh, in here. So um, you can add some other text up above it if you wanted to or you know our listings or whatever you wanted to put here. Um, you can put some styling on the on the widget. Um, over like we just did over IDX broker and then that shows here on your site. So when you publish that then let's take a quick look at what that that looks like on the site. Come over here to listings and you'll have something that looks kind of like this and this will automatically update. So as these listings come and go They'll, this will automatically update and your users can click on that and it's going to pop open a property details page like this one so you can see uh, you know what you have and if you have more listings uh, you know on any widget you click this it'll show this little uh, property results page